Hi, my name's Andrew Fredericks, and welcome back again to another flow. Uh, this one's a fairly simplistic one, but it's going to save you guys a lot of time and hassle, and it's also going to boost the way that your customer, your users are interacting and understanding your account. So um, this one relates in particular to account hierarchies and opportunities overall. Uh, so prerequisites for this is you want to have a lookup, an additional lookup field on the opportunity record called parent account. Now, you don't have to display this on the UI, but you can choose to display it on the layout itself. It could be a field in the back end that's just populated from this flow. All right. So what our business uh, scenario is, is that we want a way on the top level of the account hierarchy, so the parent of all accounts, to show and understand all the opportunities from all the related um, accounts in one view. Now to do this, it's very simple to with a lookup, but how do we get this in a way that's automated and users aren't having to populate that lookup every time? And that's where a record triggered flow comes into play. This one here in particular, we're gonna have a record triggered flow and this is gonna be a record is created or updated. And this flow is gonna run before the record is saved. So. Uh, we want to make sure it's fine before the record is saved. Just it's a lot faster because we're only updating fields on the object. Um, in particular, we're choosing the opportunity. And our condition here is that custom field I talked about before, parent account, is equal to empty string. So we're, we're making sure that parent account is empty. And we want this to evaluate every time the record is updated and meets the condition requirement. So if someone accidentally clears that field out, um, if you have it displayed on the layer, you can have this trigger again and it'll go ahead and fix it up for you. So once we've done that, very simply, we've got a decision split and we're going to check that the account is a child. So the account related to the opportunity, and that is using the standard lookup, is has a parent account in it. And the way we can do this with flows is very simple. So I'm going to walk you through how I added this in. I'm going to go to the record which triggered this phone. That's the opportunity. I'm going to go via lookup to the account ID. This is the standard one. And then we're going to check that the parent account ID field, and I can just type to get it to it quickly, does not equal an empty string. So this tells us that the account linked has a parent account linked to that as well. If it does, uh, so it does not have parent account, then we go down the other way. So essentially it does not equal empty string. That means it has a parent account. Otherwise we'll go down the default path. We'll just end it right there. So we'll kick out here. If it does, however, what we're gonna do is grab an assignment. Very easily, we're gonna update the record parent account and we're gonna make it equal to record account ID, parent account ID. And that's very, Simple and that uh, completes our update. So when you're doing a before record save, it's very important that you use assignments because you won't be able to do update record elements instead. And it's very simple and easy. So let's put this into action, right? So this is active. I'm gonna go have a look. So this one here, United Oil and Gas, that's the parent level. And I'm gonna create an op on the child level, which is United Oil and Gas Singapore. So I'm gonna go to my opportunity view. I'll create a new uh, opportunity here. Let's say the amount is $100,000, put the close date in, opportunity name, I'll call it test for now. The account name, we're gonna grab United Oil and Gas Singapore, stage, put it into prospecting, put some more information if we wanna put it in, and that's it, right? So we don't populate that for now, we'll leave it blank, I'll click save, it's going through, and going to populate that. So I look at the details and I'll have a refresh here. And as you can see, the parent account field has populated. Now, what does this look like on the parent account level? You can choose to add this as a related object on the parent account. And what I've done here is child account opportunities and it's showing all my child account opportunities there as well as the opportunities related to this parent account. Now, what you could do is you could probably play around with the layouts, um, make, make a different record type for parent accounts. So then it would show this related list only for parent accounts, not um, child accounts. It's up to you when you go to play around with it. But hopefully you found this useful. Hopefully this will speed up time 
um, and the management of your records, as well as insights into your different records. Thank you for listening and hope you enjoyed this, guys.